So let's start here by looking at a simple function in Python. Um, generally speaking, in this course, everything's going to fall into functions. Um, and we want to use the main function as our primary function. So the main function is basically, its job is to be, well, the main function, the thing that controls everything else. So we're going to create a function called main. Um, and then we're going to use this function uh, to call other functions. Now this will make more sense as we get deeper into programs. Um, but for now, we're just going to do the most basic thing, which is create a function. We always create functions with this def keyword. This means define a function. And we're going to find a function called main. And of course, because everything works in blocks in Python, we need that colon. Now anything that happens inside here is inside main. And uh, by default, let's just drop something in here. We'll say print, this is main. Now, what's gonna happen is you're gonna see nothing's really gonna work right now. When I hit run, I'm not gonna get an error. It's just gonna say, you know, nothing, right? There's nothing happening there. Um, and just ignore the name. Of course, the name's different for every one of these. Uh, so the reason for this is the way Python and frankly, most programming languages work is it reads down this left-hand line here. Um, so, you know, it looks at each of these lines and says, what do I do? Well, in this case, it says, don't do anything here. Obviously, with the comments, it says, don't do anything here. Then it says, def main. Okay, that's a function. I need to remember that for later. And then that's inside the function, so I'm not going to look at it. That's inside the function. I'm not going to look at it and then my program is over. Well, the problem is that it knows there's this main function, but it doesn't know to look at it. We actually need to call main. And what calling main is just a simple, anytime we call a function, you guys have done functions before, right? This is a function, input, you know, what's your name? That's a function, right? You can see what we're passing to the function is inside those um, parentheses. So you've been using functions for a while. Print is a function, right? That's calling a function called print. And then inside it, we say what we want to print, right? So turns out if we want to call main, same syntax. We just say main. And we're not going to send anything to main. We're just going to say call main. So now the program says, okay, ignore the comment, ignore the blank space, ignore the comment, ignore the comment. There's a function here. I need to know that there's a function, so I'll remember that. Ignore the stuff inside the functions, ignore the stuff inside the functions. That's a comment, I'll ignore it. Main, I need to go to main. So then it jumps from 10 to five here and it says, all right, now I need to read what's inside of main. So call to main, then main will run. And you can see that main runs. Now, for now, that's all you need to really understand about functions. We're going to get a lot deeper into functions and why and how we use them. Um, but for now, just remember that we want to make sure everything is inside of a function. We don't want it all over here on the left-hand side anymore. We want to make sure everything is inside of a main function or other functions as we learn more.